Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf Your One Only, and welcome to some more of the Alchemist Code. And the Disgaea event is here, and is Disgaea 5 first, and Disgaea 1 will be last. And I've already done everything. I've done the milestone table, I've done the story, and... Well, my mic destroyed itself in the middle of my recording and didn't record my voice at all. So unfortunately, this time we're going to be missing out on my story reactions and pretty much my overall first impression of the whole event. So what I can say is this event was actually pretty interesting. The story was actually pretty funny and interesting. and. I could definitely say the little free character we get from here, she's actually really adorable. I love her in the story. I am definitely getting her to 85 for sure. Now you are going to be farming for her special equipment and leveling her up. You're also going to be farming for her equipment for evolving her too. So yeah, keep that in mind. You guys have to evolve her in get her materials by the end of this event or you guys probably will be having a lot of trouble you especially have the evolver by the end of this event because if you don't evolve her by the end of this event you can't evolve her anymore why do i go to limit breaks what is the leader oh whole team gets five percent defense okay that's nice that's kind of nice and she can wield um what are they called Blacksmith hammers, by the way. Her hammer is also inside of the summons right now. Uh, it's not a free thing you can farm for. But there is a daily, like, one gem summon that's going on for her weapon. So I recommend doing those daily one gem summons before you even think about touching this. Because you're going to be pissed if you actually get the hammer through the one chimp summon I say do that on the last day on the last day if you don't get it then summon here but I'm actually looking forward to getting her hammer it seems like she it forces her to berserk though so that's gonna be interesting I definitely like this character on the field though um, I already did my few three runs on the um, item world which you guys will never see apparently thanks to the game ruining it well no thanks to my mic ruining it all uh, they they weren't actually all that difficult to be honest they were just really easy but I'm gonna run through the event again uh, sadly there won't be any story but I'll get you guys the stages and show you guys pretty much what's up nothing like extremely major all right let's start from one and show you guys what's going on. I'm going to switch these two out. Just because I want to show you guys her animation. She's actually really adorable. I love her. I love her portrait inside of the story. Episode 1. Yeah, that's what she looks like. She just swings back and forth. Oh yeah, I'm using my Ultima too, and I put enhancements on them. This is actually a pretty decent skill too. But I mostly put this on him just for the magic increase to himself. But I don't really need to do that right now. I think I can hit both of these guys with this, maybe? Nah, it won't let me. Well, that's unfortunate. Whatever. But yeah, all of this is actually a pretty easy event. I'm pretty sure they'll bring extra dungeons that'll be like a lot more difficult. I'm definitely maxing out this character. She's so adorable. I must do it. Uh, right there? There we go. 
But yeah, nothing difficult here on episode one. You guys can actually just farm her stuff easy. Nothing drastic here, no deaths, no kills. Don't use items. Well, you can use items, just don't use three of them. I don't think anything had to do with skills, though. What was this one? Yeah, item again, but you'll bring this character as well. You could just put her inside of the helper and it will still count towards that. Alright, episode 2. Wow, this is actually going to be a really short video thanks to all of this. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. But I'll make sure that my mic doesn't break itself the next Disgaea. But I'm not going to be summoning because I didn't summon for anything. All I did was the um, daily gym summon. I'm not going to be summoned for Killa or Magnus or any of them. Just because they're not really interesting for me. Like, they're good characters, but they can become outclassed real fast. But they'll be good and global for a good time period, to be honest. Can I hit him from here? Yes, I can. That answered my question. I'm just going to sit here. Oh, okay. okay. Also, by the way, I can throw characters with this character. So any of the disguise characters can throw allies. I'm going to throw you right there, Otoba. I wish Lucian was right there, but eh. Eh, I missed out on one chest. I'll be fine. Alright, which round was that? Round two? I need another scarf, apparently. Alright, so here comes episode three. There's not really any, like, gym rewards for this event so you guys really don't have to worry about that the only gym rewards we get are off the uh milestone table well the thing is i can actually show you guys my last i can actually show you guys my runs inside of the um item world That'll be at the end of the video just to end it off and show you guys the runs that I went through. And the item. There just won't be any of my voice in there. Which I, I'm pretty sure some of you guys would be thankful for. <laughs> ah, feels bad, man. I was really hoping I was going to get like a good first impression out there than I realized. I've been gypped. Are you serious? I still can't reach you. Hold on. I need to grab this first. Okay, now. I can't wait for Lahar. If I can get Lahar, I will be like extremely extremely freaking happy and this will make up for my Gilgamesh summon game yeah you guys know you BS'd me out of my Gilgamesh I gotta say if I don't get Lahar I I think I'm done summoning I, I don't think I'll ever summon again She doesn't really have any like magnificent skills in, in the world, but her skills are actually pretty decent. Rude. God darn it, I just want to get to the freaking chest. 
Because I need the beans here. Or curry. I think it's curry. Because that's what they were talking about in the story. You'll be fine walking off. Don't look at me like that. You knew what this was. <laughs> Alright. So let's go ahead and move on to episode 4. Okay, I need like a few more of that so I know where to go. Episode 3 is where I farm those. Episode 4. You don't really need helpers in here, but if you're like really low level, then helpers would probably be the best thing. But for new players, you guys should be able to do this with ease. Or somewhat of ease. I'm gonna just go ahead and do this. Get those annoying things out of the way. What? What are you doing? Lucian, go right there. I don't think I can hit you. Yeah, figured. There we go. Get rid of you. You actually get to use the characters through the event. They aren't like NPCs, thankfully. Yeah, I bet you won't step over here. I dare you. She's not gonna get anywhere, like, much. Oh dear god. Oh, so she has a charm as her counter, okay. Oh, I'm surprised you actually walked into that. That's awkward. No. Darn it. I was going to tell you to leave it. <laughs> Go ahead. Do it. I dare you. I'll just you wait. As soon as I get this chest up from over here, I'm going to come after you real soon. Yeah, this is where you get her equipment. What I tell you, leave it. Alright, so last event coming up. Yeah, people are going to be like really surprised that I made like a shorter video. This is actually how long these videos take without story the original video i had was going to be a whole hour and like 20 minutes this is literally how fast it is without story and i put all the story at the end of the video <laughs> so if you guys ever see like a large video you can just go ahead and guess to yourself that it's going to be like pretty short unless you want to see the story let's go ahead and hit you with this oh hit him Hit him, thank you. So these um, penguins, they aren't really special from what I know. They don't seem like they do a lot of things. I do want to come over here 
and kill these guys because I'm pretty sure this is yeah charm and healing you definitely want to kill oh well apparently she could have killed all three of them that AoE is like it's hardly strong I'm happy that I finished her So Kilia does have like different moves. He has water, fire, and dark. Mostly fire stuff though. So now we moved him out of the way. I was hoping we could like, get a little bit of distance here. There we go. Oh, Kilia's dying if I do that. Okay, never mind. Didn't see that one coming. Alright then, never mind. I'm just gonna stop that there and just call that a turn. Go ahead and put you out of your misery. And I'm gonna go up here and stop this Mandrake from doing whatever he feels like doing right now. I don't even know what this thing is. Oh, just a light Mandrake. Well, never mind. We're gonna see what the light Mandrake does. I don't think it's anything special. Not yeah. He's not gonna do anything special since nobody's over there. Nobody's over there for him to torture. Feels bad, man. And Sandragon does not really do damage. It's, it'll still do one damage since it's like one hit. I don't think I can reach over there. Yeah, as you can see, they don't really do anything significant. I wonder. Okay, yeah, I would still want to do one. And that's all she wrote. Ah, oh, yeah, that's 50. Oh, so just, she just whacks him. <laughs> okay. So that's pretty much all of the events. Nothing like really significant. Uh, so round two starts probably next week or two weeks from now. And that will be when Lahar comes out. I think Lahar is probably next week, if anything. Then they'll probably just be switching banners and everything. Uh, I'm not sure if it's like a guarantee or anything, but we shall see. Seems like they got this going on, which I haven't touched, thankfully. <laughs> so I can give you guys the first impression on that. Sorry for the hiccups. Jesus. I think they're more like mini burps that keep trying to come up. Doesn't tell me I can't use a mercenary, so I'm going to use a mercenary.
just to speed this up a little bit faster. So let's see what's in here. All right, so just these guys. Seems like a normal average freaking dungeon. How much HP do they have? They got seven HP. And the rats, let's see, they got nine. And now this one has done. So I don't know what they do special from the... Special for the rats. Okay, clearly that's not going to work. Uh, let's just go ahead and damage multiple. See if I can go around punching the rats and getting jewels. Doesn't seem like the rats really put up that much of a fight. I gotta do the same thing here. Okay, never mind. I thought I could do the same thing there. Apparently not. What about here? Okay, no, I would kill Ultima. G's game? Fine. I didn't care anyway. Yeah, either way it goes, I'm gonna be killing Ultima. Ah, uh, game, why do you choose to bully me? They're like, no, you're not allowed to do this. Yeah, this is not gonna work either. Either way it goes, I'm still gonna hit one character. Fine, I'm just gonna go right here. How do you like that game? Just gonna sit right here. Yeah, because Gilgamesh is allowed to do that. Yeah. Game, why do you hate so much? Actually, I'm gonna let you do that. Seems like these penguins are gonna take their sweet time on their turns. No jewels for you. No jewel. Oh. <laughs> okay then. I can hit him past this rock. I was about to say, if this rock stops that attack, then there's something really amazing about this rock. Um. Oh, okay. And we can kill the last rat so we don't get immobilized. now I'm buddy probably a lot of places you can go at this point Bringing them down. 
Ow. Jerk. Ow. Jerk. But I'll definitely make sure to have my first impression of round two for sure. Killian's event was, like I said, pretty interesting, but I mostly will probably enjoy Lahar. I'm really hoping Lahar and Julia meet each other. And I never played like any of the Disgaea games. So I actually plan on, you know, playing them later on. So maybe I might do an upload of the Disgaea games. Not fully sure yet. Not even sure if that's something people want to see. Well, We'll see, because I plan on starting from the very first one, which I'm pretty sure is probably on Game Boy or something. I wish emulators weren't just getting taken down left and right, thanks to Nintendo. But we will see if I can get my hands on it. We shall see. Because I know a, a few of them are on Steam. So, yeah. We shall see. Let's go ahead and sell this. Oh my god, my precious gold is coming back to me for now. Ah, uh, feels good, man. Feels so freaking good. But here are the three runs I did inside of the item shop. Well, no item shop. The world item. Uh, first, speaking of shop, never mind. Hold on. Before I let you guys go and watch that. These events are here. These are the tower currencies that you can get. And there are a lot of good rewards in here. I would recommend getting at least these four right here. This right here if you're really annoyed at farming compasses. Um, you can get these if you want to. I'm not sure how much currency the item world has for its tower. That's the only thing that puzzles me a little bit. Is I'm just wondering... So, are we going to have to spin wisely in here? I'm pretty sure we might have to spin right wisely. I think that's what they're going to make us do, at least. Alright. This next one, you can get from just logging in. And this is Lahar right here. If you guys have been wondering what he looks like, this is him. So, I'm definitely summoning inside of Lahar's banner just because of these three right here. Succubus Rosa could actually be interesting. I might get some Bolt shards, because Bolt is almost to level 75 for me. I just did not farm his stuff, so I hope his uh, plus comes back soon. Uh, this character is also in Lahar's banner. So, one, two, three, four. So, Lahar has four people inside of his. Kilia has these these three right here and this one so yeah that's pretty much it you can also get these guys shards over here if you don't feel like farming them but these two are free units so don't waste your coins on it it would probably be the bad a bad investment to be honest but i'm gonna let you guys go and see my um my three runs inside the tower so you guys can get a little bit of what's going to be going on for the first three. It's actually pretty easy, straightforward. They're pretty much lined up to where I can just kill them all. <laughs> but, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time on the next one. Till then, peace out.
残念でしたこれにて終了ですよっとくらえうわもう一度はエッチを上がりにくいのがいいんだけどねの贈り物かどれどれれ何かお探しですかありがとうございました面倒い。さーて行きますか。残念でしたこれにて終了です命を奪う気なら容赦はしないおやつの時間だから手短にね見下してると痛い目見るわよやるよおさとうパワーこれ残念でしたこれにて終了ですエッチを上がりさーて行きますか残念でしたこれにて終了ですよっとくらえお俺様がマジか命を奪う気なら容赦はしない
おやつの時間だから手短にねしてると痛い目見るわよ決めてやるよ儚く知りなさいお砂糖パワーそれ残念でしたこれにてよっと終了決めてやるよさらっやっザクザほらこんなもんって感じかと lose. 